Facebook Live. <laughs> a second bi-weekly diff Facebook, diff chats, diff Facebook Lives, and welcome to our YouTube audience as well. We're here in absolutely beautiful sunny cows today. We thought we're out, in the, out of the office doing some thinking, so we thought we'd um, bring you a little view of, uh, of our view today during this endless endless summer that we're enjoying so just a reminder why we're doing these shows we're trying to give you a little insight to the build-up to the diff so we'll be talking about how you can get involved who's going to be speaking any other news and updates and today to talk to some of that to talk about some of that with me is Emily Schedule. Hi, Hello Bob. Emily and what do you do on the diff team? So I'm the diff communications coordinator uh, so that involves doing various things throughout the year posting key messages and calls to action this is through news items uh, the diff social media channels um, prompting various things across the website and making sure that's all in order for those key messages. Yeah, and just a reminder, I'm certainly part of the social media team and I also work a lot with the contributors who apply to speak on our on our website. You can hear a speedboat, a speedboat I think, in the background. <laughs> various We've got the lovely water um, out there um, and we're giving you another little pan shot of, uh, of our view today. Well, a few of you join us, get online. Um, great to have you with us on our Facebook page. Remember to share our stuff on social media, like our Facebook page, like our YouTube videos, give us your comments, do all those nice things. Give us a comment. We love our comments. Use hashtag ThinkDiff and sign up to our newsletter if you haven't already as well. Yeah. That's a great way to get all the latest updates and news straight from the Diff team. Your comments are our oxygen. That's what <laughs> say. Um, okay, great. So during this uh, next few minutes, we're going to talk a little bit about the formats of the Diff. For those of you who are thinking about applying to speak, how do you do that and what kind of options do you have and what kind of sessions can you expect if you're thinking oh I wonder what I'm going to watch this November. We're going to learn a bit more about Emily, we've got a quick fire round of questions to find out a bit more about Emily and we'll be giving you a quick rundown of a couple of new updates to uh, the website and what you can explore on our channels right now. Um, so to start with we've got a little game Emily. We do. We're we're gonna, we've got four slips of paper, we're going to draw them somewhat randomly. Completely randomly. <laughs> Completely randomly. And uh, whichever paper we draw, we have to explain what uh, what that format is, how people can get involved with it. Just explain it a little bit. Yeah. Do you want to go first, exactly. Emily? I think we should. I'll go, oh, first. Yeah, you go first. I'll go first. Okay. So first one, diff on air. I don't know if we can see that on the camera. Diff on air. So diff on air is for uh, is mostly done by Google Hangouts. It's a conversation, it's a discussion, it's a place to bring, if you're applying to speak, it's a place to uh, start a conversation, share an inspiring idea. You can take your Google Hangouts to somewhere, you can show something physical, a product or a factory where you work or do something or make something. Um, it's the easiest sort of live stream global option we have. It requires not too much tech, relatively, if you can get good audio with a microphone and a decent internet connection, you can host them. We have lots of great discussions. They're always available as great recordings to watch as well. Um, so if you're looking to start some sort of conversation, get some sort of interaction from the audience, Diff on Air is a great way to go. Somewhere that perfect, so what have I got? Diff Podcast. Um, so this is something that's been around for a relatively long time, but trying to plug it more this year. Um, so Diff Podcast, that can be a single podcast or series of podcasts. It's great for if you're a little bit camera shy, which I know some people might be. Um, so it's really simple, you can just upload via SoundCloud or any other medium that you think would work well for you. A conversational style with just yourself, with a group of people, talking about subjects you're interested in, topics you're interested in, or telling us a story of some sort. Um, in length, maybe like 5 to 25 minutes um, is, a, is a generally a good length for, for podcasts. Um, yeah, and we're trying to push them more this year. Bring, give us your podcasts. Yeah, get on that microphone. So what have I got? Diff film. So this is the last of the formats that you can directly apply to host of our four formats. Um, so Diff Films, basically make a video. Um, show us something, uh, have a collection of interviews that tell a story, um, present uh, an idea. What obviously you need to remember is that attention spans are not super long, so you want to create either something super engaging, in-depth insight, decent quality video if you can, but the quality of the story is really key. Um, so if you create a video, create a film, share it with us and we post it onto the diff schedule and we, every day we post during the diff, we post new films, um, some created by the foundation, the foundation creates some films as well. Uh, we've got two this year, Emily, which we'll be talking about on a future bi-weekly uh, show. Um, we'll have more details, details about them, two big ones. 
um, but we always have a lot of films and videos in from our contributors as well. And last one, we've got Diff Studio. This is the one we're expecting. <laughs> this is the one we're expecting. So this is the one that you can't apply to directly through the website. But if you do have any sort of contributors you think would be really good to have in our live studio, then you can post them through Twitter, Facebook, comment, email us directly. So these are live studio guests that we invite directly to the studio in Cows on the Isle of Wight. And um, they come and sit in our Diff Studio sofa, or they can tune in online on our big screen. Um, and we have various diff team hosts that will interview them. Um, yeah, so this is kind of our, our big players. These are the ones you should definitely be tuning in to watch if you're not contributing yourselves. There's a handful of those already available to view on the diff website on the home page. So yeah. You'll see some of our early, early speakers. Okay, so that's go to the website. There's a button at the top that says apply to speak. Decide what format you are. Or submit your idea and talk to us about the format that's most suitable for it. Basically, it's do something live, create a film a podcast. Um, the quality of the story and the idea is what we're really looking for. We can support a bit on making sure the tech is um, as, as enjoyable for the audience as possible, but our audience want to hear your stories. Okay, so we've done the sessions. That means that it's time for quick fire question round. Question time. With Emily Schedule. Okay. Camera's panning away, board of Emily Schedule, seeing the car ferry, the Red Funnel car ferry coming into, coming into port. Um, okay, so the idea of this round is you're not allowed to spend any time thinking about this. You've just got to give us an instant, quick answer, okay? Okay, let's do this. So, number one, favourite hobby? Oh, I'm a bit of a yogi. Yoga. Yoga. Favourite song? Uh, favourite song, uh, Toto Africa. Africa. Toto Africa. I think that would be my first dance at my wedding. Wow, okay. <laughs> that's, that's telling us a lot more than we, maybe some of the audience members wanted to know. Films or books? Uh, I'd like to say books, but if I'm being honest, films. Okay. What's your biggest inspiration? Eminem. <laughs> You're going to rap for us? No, no not this time. <laughs> What's your favourite colour? Uh, green. And the best diff session you've ever hosted? Ah, uh, that'll be last year, 2017, when I was in the live studio and we had Charmian Love from B Corp UK, and that was my first hosting experience in the live studio, and it was great. Great yeah, session. You two got on like a house. We did, yeah. <laughs> uh, best you've watched? Best of session, Ooh, best of session I've watched? Uh, probably Kate Rayworth. That was the last year's session as well. She's in the live studio being interviewed by her own Joss Blériot. And it was a really fun interactive session. She brought in loads of her own tools. And, yeah, it was great. And that session is available on the DIFF website right yeah. now. And our Best of the DIFF 2017 playlist, which is on the home page. So yeah, scroll down the home page, Best of DIFF 2017. You'll find Kate Rayworth and a selection of other sessions will actually give you a flavour of what you can expect this November. Uh, would you rather, or what's, who's your favourite DIFF team member? <laughs> oh, you can't make me say that. Who's your favourite DIFF team member? My favourite DIFF team member. Me, it's um, uh, gonna have to go Kinga, she's a, she's a DIFF boss, so yeah, Kinga, she's oh, Kinga we've, brought, we've paused due to connection issues. We've got some connection issues on Facebook, YouTube's still going. Uh, okay, so would you rather teleport anywhere, be able to teleport anywhere in the world, mm -hmm. or be able to read anyone's minds? Teleport anywhere in the world instantly, just like that would be great. Right, yeah, you don't really want to read minds. No, I wouldn't want to know what's going on. So. And would you rather, it's a final question, yeah. would you rather live inside a giant dessert or a giant desert? <laughs> uh, dessert. I'm a, yeah, I've got a sweet tooth. Live inside a dessert. Let them inside a giant dessert. Okay, so actually, we asked that same question to Kinga last week and she said she'd rather live in a giant desert. What? There you go. Dry yeah, out. Crazy, yeah. Uh, okay, so that's quick fire questions done with Emily. We just before we go, thank you for Can joining us. Can I come out of glasses? Yeah, I'm, I'm looking sorry, quite I haven't cool. got my. I feel inferior here, and the t-shirt. Is that? Yeah, that is friendly. I didn't know that's going to be a rude one. So <laughs> <laughs> that is media friendly. Yeah, we don't dress up as smart for these bi-weekly Facebook lives. <laughs> hey. <laughs> well, you did. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah. No nice sunglasses. It was a beautiful sunny day here in Cowes. So why wouldn't you? crack out with Ducatis. This is true and actually Seb's glasses also feature in our DIFF homepage um, where you can find out more about the team. So we've just uploaded a team page recently which you can find in the footer on the about page and that tells you about every single member of the team and Seb is sporting her sunglasses there as well That's, along with some other team that members. That was one of the best segues we've probably ever had <laughs> during the DIFF so far. Uh, okay, well that's, that's great. So the diff we've got on the diff site at the moment, we've got we've mentioned the best of 2017 playlist. We have, yeah. We've got the meet the new meet the team page you can find, find out more about the team. Um, and obviously you can see who's there to speak and if you're in who's already been announced as a speaker you're interested in speaking make sure you go to apply to speak there's a quick form tell us your idea 
and we'll get back to you um, as quickly as possible. But that's all from us this time. Rose, you're going to do a pan around so we see the Last person behind the, the camera. Oh, you want to see me? Well, yeah, I think they do. You see Stu? <laughs> Thanks for joining us. We can work out how to pan. There we go. They're done. See Bye, you everyone. Soon. Bye.